With a proto-sundial, an astute observer in the Bronze Age could discern the shortest day of the year by determining the day with the longest shadow at midday, and the longest day of the year by determining the day with the shortest shadow at midday. Continued observation over time would have shown that this happened somewhat regularly, but without a counting system it was not possible to know the number of days between these events, hence one could not know when the next event was coming. Bronze Age peoples did not have a written language or system of counting, but this did not preclude enumerating by making a mark each day on a stick or placing a stone in a pile each day. An observer could have started at the longest day of the year and added one stone each day to a pile until his shadow clock told him he was at the shortest day of the year. He would then know that taking a stone away each day should take him back to the longest day. A little prior planning and he could guess that he might want to know when he was halfway there. To do this, he would need to move two stones from the pile each day and create two separate piles. When the original pile was exhausted, he would now be halfway to the longest day and have two equal piles of stones. This would be equivalent to getting to the vernal, or spring equinox, a very important day for an agricultural society as the warm growing season was approaching. The same observer could not precisely determine the equinox from his shadow clock, but he could make note of the fact that the length of the shadow at midday was halfway between the shadows of the longest and shortest day. Now he would move the stone from one pile until he exhausted that pile. He would then be back at the longest day, which he could check with his shadow clock. Recombining the stones from the first pile with the second pile would get him to the autumnal equinox. He would now know that splitting the pile of stones again would get him to the shortest day. Using the stone piles in this repeating sequence would be equivalent to a calendar that would let him know with fair accuracy when these critical days were coming. Check out the website to find out where you can get Christos Chronicles, Book 1, The King's Challenge, to learn other clever methods for determining these days.